okay so let's take a look at how you can create a set in apex using your salesforce developer console so what we're going to do is open developer console and then once it is loaded we will open anonymous execution window okay so let's open that if you already have any code you can remove that now here what i'm going to do is i'm going to type in keyword set and then pass what the value i wish to add in it so set string and here let's see i want to add product set and it's going to be a custom one so i'm not fetching anything from uh, salesforce okay so let's add new set string and we will basically add elements let's see pen then pepper sorry within quote paper and then book make sure to end this with semicolon okay otherwise if there are any errors we may be searching for where exactly that would be okay then we will use system.debug and we will see products in set would be our product set okay so it should output these values pen paper book with that make sure to also in this statement with semicolon and then execute if there are any errors that may appear or we will directly be moving to the log so considering there are no errors it is showing me the log okay so check for event user debug in user debug we will find our products in set and you will see book paper and pen these are the values that we want it as output and you got it so you get the idea how to create set in apex with salesforce developer console